Hello, this is Stacy from Lee Page's technical support team. Here's today's tech tip. Today we'll be talking all about linking to your pages and page sections within your site. Throughout your site, you may want to have easy links to other pages or sections on your site. I'm going to show you how that is possible. To link to a page, simply hover over the widget you want to link. In this case, I'm going to use this widget. Click the pencil. From there, click the hyperlink. You will get a drop down list of everything you can link to, but I'm going to link to a page. From here, you'll see select a page, place your cursor inside of there, and you'll get a drop down of all of your pages. You can also search for your page that you want. So let's say I want to link this to my contact page. I can search for contact and it pulls it right up. Click save and now this will link directly to my contact page. I'm going to demonstrate this in preview. Once in preview I can click on this and it takes me directly to my contact page. So this is an easy way to link to my contact page somewhere on the main page. I can also link to a specific section on a page. To do that I'm going to pull out a button widget. I'm going to drag this out here we have an additional option to link. I can hover over this and click add a click event. From there I get that same menu and then I can go to link to a page section. There I'll get that same select a page. In this case I want to go to locations but I want to go directly to the map. So in here I can select a section and the same thing goes as linking to a page. I can search through this to find the section I want. So I can go down and I want to link to location 2. I'll hit save and now it's connected. I could have also done the pencil here and got the same options. I'm going to show you this in preview as well. Once in preview, I can click the button and it takes me directly to location two on my locations page. I can also link to pages and page sections in my main navigation. To do that, I'll click on pages in the left corner, click on this, on this plus sign, there I can go to link, here I can create my link test, and I'm going to put test for my link text, and then I can select the page. So maybe I want to go to my testimonials this time, and then I can go to a, a particular section, so maybe directly to the testimonials. I could also link it to an external URL or a landing page, so if I want to link to my other lead pages, I could do that as well. I'm going to click save, and now this will link to my testimonials. I'll show you that in preview as well. So when I click on test, it goes to my testimonials. I can also remove a link that I have. So let's say I decided I don't want to link to my locations, but I want to link to a, lo a lead page. So what I can do is edit click event and then remove. And the same thing goes if I was doing um, the other widget, you would just do the pencil first. But I can hit remove. From there, I can link to a lead page. And then let's say I want to go have them go to a consultation instead. I'm going to click on that. I can have it open in a new window, so that means it's going to open a new window instead of floating on the page, which is what I'm going to do. And then I'll show you in preview. Okay, so now when I click on this, it takes me into a new window to my consultation page. I hope you enjoyed today's video, but as always, if you have any questions, you can click on the question mark and search our knowledge base here, or you can contact your support team. We'd be happy to help.